I'm Shannon Grossi with Versatile Software Training, and I'm here to show you how to create a fill-in-the-blank form in Microsoft Word. The first thing you're going to need to do is add a, another tab to your ribbon because that will contain your form controls. So we're going to click over here on File and come down to Options. And over on the left-hand side, you have some choices. We're going to come down to Customize Ribbon. And over on the right, you'll see an area called Main Tabs. And most of them have a check mark, but there's one that doesn't, and that's the Developer tab. And that's the one we need to create these fill-in-the-blank forms. So I check that box and click OK. And if you look up at the ribbon, you'll see you have a new Developer tab. So we'll go ahead and click there. And we're going to hang out in this group called Controls. All right, so we're ready to start the form. I personally like to create forms in a table, so I have control over the structure. And I can always hide those borders as well. So I'm here at Name. I'm going to press Space just to give a little space there. And in the Controls group, these are all my form options. And the first one that I'm hovering over will allow a placeholder to be displayed there. And that's how you can create those fill in the blank forms. So now I go through and decide where to put these. So again, I'll come down here now by department and I want to space and insert that. Now my next one's going to be a date. So after I put my space, if you look up at controls, you'll see there's one that's a calendar. And that one's really great because it will create a drop down list with a calendar. And then anyone filling out the form just picks the date. And over here, when the, so I've created this vacation request form. So anyone coming along to fill it out, I will already set up a method for them to know what parts of it to fill out. And then last, I'm going to go back to my fill in the form. And then I've added all of the components here. So now what I'm going to do is save it. And then if I am the one that's going to fill the form out, here's how that's going to look. I would just click where it says click here to enter text. And I could type my name. And I could go down to department and type department. So as you can see, I have all these great places to know where to go. And now when I get down to the date, I have a drop down arrow. And there's my calendar. So I am sure to pick the right dates of my vacation. And so on. So that's really the, the trick is to make sure to put that developer tab on and you have these really great controls in there to create a form that other people could fill out in your organization. I'm Shannon Grossi and that's how you can create a fill in the blank form in Word.